birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in we just got done eating. We went to like this little town in the middle of like nowhere, like literally nowhere. And the food was not, it was not all that. Now we're getting back on a roll. We have like about an hour left until we get to our cabin. I'm so excited, I cannot wait. And then I don't know what we're doing from there. I guess you guys will see and I will too. That's what's going on right now. Something over there, I guess we'll check that out. <laughs> okay, so here's the tour. You come in, this is the door. Here is what, oh, cute. They got robes out here. Okay, so you come in. The first thing we see is the living room. As you can see, we got a recliner, a TV, a couch, and then you come over here. It's like the kitchen dinette area, the table, of course. Fridge. Let's see if there's anything in here. Nope, completely empty. Stove, sink, and then you come this way. Oh, here's a heater too. Nice. Um, then you come this way, and it's like the bedroom. It's tall, but it's pretty small. But the height make it look bigger, even though it's really not at all. So here's the bedroom. Come out of here. You come over here. This is the bath. Then here is the bathroom mirror cute little oh I like this it's the barn doors okay hair dryer towels washcloth Ooh, clean people clean people washcloths toilet whatever that stuff is a cute little showers nothing like major sure I always wear shower shoes so I don't really worry about the ground not gonna lie I mean I do but I don't also has like a first aid kit. So yeah, that's the bathroom. And the living room. Here are some stairs. And it just takes you up to a cute little loft area. Say hi, babe. Hi, babe. <laughs> Here it is. I love this rocking chair. I think I'm gonna have to get one. It's a recliner rocking chair. Oh, there's the rain. And this is what I've been looking forward to. The jacuzzi. It's coming down. Oh my goodness. What? Oh, it's just the perfect day for this. It was. So it started freaking raining. got done watching six days seven nights and if you guys haven't watched it i highly recommend you guys watch it it's a romance and i liked it i really really enjoyed it there are some parts when it comes to you know cheating and stuff i get very irritated by that kind of stuff but even though the movie was still really good so i highly recommend you guys watch it but it's on hulu right that was Mima. yes so it's on hulu but right now we're about to hit to get some dinner. I think we're going to this pizza place called, what is it called? Pops. What is it called? Papa. Papadinos? Papadinos, that's it. 
Papadinos. They got a really high rating on their pizza and it looks like that they make their own dough at their restaurant, so. Yeah, but we are kind of in the middle of nowhere, so I mean, I can't expect it to be. Oh, it's literally right here? Oh, How yeah. fast was that? That was literally 30 seconds. Yeah, and it's closed. Wait, what? You see the signs that say closed? What the? What if they close? Due to unforeseen sir. Oh, wow. Just got done eating, about to head to the gas station and then back to the cabin. I'm thinking we're gonna get in the jacuzzi when we get back because it stopped raining, thank God. I'm gonna show you guys what we got from the gas station, our little snack haul. I picked out the snacks because my boyfriend is terrible at picking out snacks. Nobody eats the snacks he pick out. Not even him. So the first thing I got is some Sprite. I'm gonna have this with my little liquor. liquor. Next thing I got is some orange juice, 100% orange juice. Ew, that's not like fart. The water? That's well water. Oh, it must be the sink. That's well water for you. That shit stank. That's well water? Yeah. I'm so happy I grabbed that water. Yeah. Well, never and it's well. safe to drink? Yeah, you never smelled it before? Oh, no. Yeah. And then I got the original sunflower seeds. I feel like these would be good for our hike tomorrow. You smell it in I have to get a honey bun. I absolutely love honey buns. And I only like this type, like this uh, brand. And then I also got some Lifesaver gummies because you can't go wrong with these. My boyfriend got him a Sprite too. And then I got two protein bars for us on our hike tomorrow. What, babe? Just us out here. Just us? Just us. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we are now getting it. I got my little drink here. My boyfriend actually made it for me and it's really good. But we're about to go ahead and get in the hot tub. Open it. You know what I mean? Push it up. Push it up. Push it up. Push it up. You should listen to me sometime. This is exactly what I was trying to do. No way. Yeah. You want to say get more or are you going to... Oh, that's nice. What are you twisting things for? I just turned the jet on. This is such a beautiful moment. Like, I'm not even kidding you guys. Like, we had a jacuzzi in Medellin, but it was like outside, inside, if that makes sense. Like, it was indoors, but the top was open, if that makes sense. But right now, we're like literally in nature. Yes, we have like this little patio thing, but like, it's legit nature. Like, what do you think, babe? We are in nature. I mean, there's woods and trees all around us. It's private. Um, it's really yeah. nice. Yeah. Nice little cabin experience, nice hot tub. It would be great in the fall or winter, but it's great now. Too. True, with some snow falling. Good morning, you guys. It's day two. We're going to a cave. I think it's the old man's cave. And then after that, we're going to do a little bit of hiking pretty excited for today because yesterday when i tell you guys it was like an ama like insane storm it was raining raining all day and all night like literally the good news is the sun is out a little bit it looks super freaking pretty so i'm excited for that my boyfriend was trying to go yesterday which is like psycho because i'm just like don't caves flood <laughs> so he was like not all of them i said well i'm not trying to find out which ones do and don't the storm was insane and rained literally all day like from the moment we got here which was like at three to like freaking all night like all night it was super cozy relaxing we put on a movie it was a great time we had a great time just chilling in a cabin you know because you could literally hear the raindrops but um, it was it was a lot yesterday it was a lot um there were branches falling on the cabin but yeah the rain was it was a crazy storm last night even like i think a tree fell over somewhere around here and so there's like multiple cabins where we are and some power went out at some of the cabins or is the end 
unfortunately, thank God. But yeah, we are on our way to Old Man's Cave. In okay guys so we just got here it's a trail to the cave it's kind of like a it's called old man ash no no it's just called ash cave is it i thought yeah. we was going to old man's cave i think old man's cave is a different one. Oh, I so i i combined well, the two i didn't even have it right actually, the name there's quite a few caves but i think ash and old man's are the two most like popular for some reason so we'll see okay we will see why so we're going to ash cave and there's a trail to there and the lady, my boyfriend just asked, she said, that's really cool. So I'm excited for it. Found what we're looking for in life. Call us crazy, but things are finally right. With you and I, the future is bright. Wow, you guys, this is insane. So we made it to the cave. This is crazy. It's like sand or I don't know what that is. Yeah, it's pretty freaking cool. Before I sleep, hear the cricket see. Side side and through and through No limit to what we can do Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Find what we're looking for in life We call us crazy, but things are finally right No, Peter drive down Gorgeous, gorgeous. Gorgeous, darling, gorgeous. <laughs> We're here at this beautiful waterfall. Excuse the lighting. It's pretty dark because there's a cave behind me. It's kind of amazing. I have no clue what it's called. But this like whole trail I, now I get why Hawking Hills get the rep that they get because it's literally absolutely beautiful out here and I'm from Ohio. That's the thing. Um, my hometown is like maybe three, three and a half hours away from Hawking Hills and this is the first time I've ever been here, like in my life. So that's pretty funny. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> Looks nice and calm. I'm gonna go down there for a second. I don't know if we're done with the trail yet, but it kind of feels like it. It feels like it's done. Y'all, we seen this on our way to the hike. It's literally just like this place. It's called Grandma Thay's. It's like grocery store, carry out, gifts, souvenirs. Yeah, that was the best like food we've had since we got on a freaking road yesterday. I'm not kidding. It was a really good day. It's about, it's one, well it's two o'clock now. We're heading back to the cabin. We're gonna go ahead and jump in the jacuzzi. Get us a nice shower, chill out for the rest of the night, and then we'll be getting on a work road pretty early tomorrow. It was such a perfect day though. When I say perfect, I mean it was so good. I failed my glutes, okay? This ass is gonna be fat in no time. <laughs> Tell them your line that you made up today. I don't know. You said, wow, babe, that was a perfectly splendid way to spend the perfectly splendid day was that it mm-hmm as you guys can see I I came up with that can I tell what you think about the trip well it was really good and then my girlfriend wanted to leave early even though we paid for a second night at the cabin lies first of all he's the one that goes babe you want to leave and I go no, sure why not no I was standing next to the bed you were in the bed and you said babe you know it, 
if we're just gonna leave in the morning, well, we, we just wanna go now? And I was like, oh, yeah, sure, if you do. Switch it around, him saying all this, and then me saying, sure. You don't remember me saying, yeah, if you want to, I will. Yeah, but that was after you asked me, and then I said, babe, I'm serious, I said, babe, it doesn't matter. I was like, do you want to leave? Because he started mess he started messing with me. And I'm like, what is going on here? I was like, babe, do you actually want to leave? Because if you do, we can. But if you don't, we can stay. I'm like, cool, well, either one. But, yeah. So, like, just switched the story around. And, yeah, he you was. You subconsciously asked me. You didn't even I, say it out loud. I can read your I thoughts. didn't. Okay, so I did. When we did get off the jacuzzi and we, like, we got in the shower, all that good stuff. I was just sitting there like, dang, if we, in my head. And I said we might as well leave tonight, but I wasn't gonna say nothing because did, I, I want I want him. If he didn't want to leave, I didn't want to say anything. You know what I, I mean? Because like it's not like we can do more tomorrow. We literally got to check out 11 a.m. I heard your thoughts. He said he wanted to leave early in the morning, like at six in the morning. And I'm just like, okay, like that's cool, but it's only four o'clock right now, and I'm just like, well, we have time to get home. We'll still get home at a decent, like it's literally around seven, eight o'clock. So it makes sense. Like, cause we, we're not doing anything tomorrow. I can understand if we have plans tomorrow, but absolutely not. Like, we're gonna soak this stuff in, but we, we don't have any plans or anything. We did everything today, so, yeah. But you are admitting that I read your mind. Yes. It was, honestly, it was a great vacation. I give it a nine out of 10. I recommend that you guys do it like if you want to stay i highly recommend the only thing i didn't like the reason why i'm giving it a nine out of ten is because we were showering with sulfur water so like well, you, well water well water well we, water we were showering and all that stuff with well water it has like a i know it's safe so. to drink i just i'm not a big fan of that smell at all so like even when i was showering i had to like stick my nose out because it just felt so freaking bad overall it was a great little getaway i absolutely oh, loved it everything was amazing i absolutely loved it i feel like i haven't been on a hike that was this good that we did today since we were in seattle and that was like two years ago yeah maybe three yeah like maybe years two three years ago and when i see you guys that was one of the best hikes i ever had in seattle the scenery the just like the working out all of it was just so good and today i feel like here in ohio actually i go it's pretty equivalent to the hike we did in seattle i most definitely recommend if you guys get a chance to most definitely come out here to ohio hawking hills because it was great but that's about it 